Hey guys, it's John, and today we are playing Whispers. This is a $5 indie horror game on Steam, and there's no menu music. If you'd like to know what the game is about, I will gladly read you the Steam store description. Whispers is a first-person horror game. You play the role as a caretaker of a house out in the country. You have to keep an eye on the house for your friend. The house is located somewhere in a field away from the city. He left instructions for you to follow. Nothing complicated, just take the premise and keep the house clean. Whatever is wrong with the house is something you will find out. Features interactive gameplay, modern graphics, stunning sounds, jump scares, and an atmospheric ambiance, plus puzzles for you to solve all around. So it sounds great. Let's go ahead and start a new game by clicking on the lamp. I work at country houses as a superintendent and take care of the houses when the owners leave. Okay. And now I go to one kind of work. You mean like it's unique or... Mr. Johnson sent me a message. Who the fuck is Mr. Johnson? That is Russian. It seemed strange to me. He usually calls me. Hmm. Alright, that's enough setup for the entire game, I think. Let's go ahead and uh, jump into it. Oh. I have to pay the rent, guys. I gotta... I gotta pay it with something. So, here we are. Alright! F skip. Okay. F1 information. F F1. Okay, so here's the controls. Very, very basic stuff. Left mouse button fire. So it's a it's a first person shooter then, right? Here wait. E is to use. I guess we can't click on this uh, lantern. That's fine. Hey, this door's chained up. Hello, Silent Hill for the room. Door is blocked. Okay. Another lantern. Nice of him to light the path like that. I guess we'll go around the back if we can't get in that way. Oh, oh, it was just it was just this uh master switch in the power box outside. There we go. Fixed everything. Now we can go inside. I'm gonna laugh if the door is not blocked anymore. Okay, door's still blocked, that's fine. Um, not really sure what that did then. I probably had to do it for something though. Maybe it powered down some sort of security system. All right, here we are guys. Oh, that was me, I did that. I, I, I bumped into the low res chain. Wait, watch it, watch it. It. It gets rid of, it gets rid of the, the bottle, look. Oh, amazing. So this is ammo. Uh, good, can I like, take it? Do I need to get a gun or? Okay, here's an ax. I'll uh, take that. Now what is, I guess this is just to get rid of the chains. Okay, I'm fine with that. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah! That was the perfect angle to <laughs> chop up those chains. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Well, we're inside the house now. Uh, there was some ammo back there that I couldn't pick up, apparently. I need to already have a gun? Ooh. Mr. Johnson left a set of rules in the house. I need to find them. Rules? What kind of rules? Interesting that you walk in the house and immediately go upstairs. Let's uh, let's check out the rest of it. You can save your game in a typewriter. Hello, Resident Evil. That's fun, actually. I'll just take its word for it that it's saved. Okay, this isn't like terrible so far, so I'm gonna be cautiously optimistic for the rest of the playthrough. We'll just, we'll see. I forgot to say that the bathroom light burned out, so enjoy the lamp. I apologize for the inconvenience. Enjoy the lamp, you cheeky fucker. All right, 
Um, there is nothing to ignite. Okay, so apparently we're supposed to get... Oh, oh, oh! Well, I want the lamp. <laughs> I can't, are, you, are you telling me I can't get in the, uh... But isn't... Don't you space to jump? No, you don't jump. I can't get the, the lamp, so I guess I'll just, uh, shit in the dark? That sounds uncomfortable. More than an inconvenience, if you ask me. So it's, um, currently 9 o'clock. Not that that has any bearing on anything. Oh, a goblet! Fit for kings! Cup for the first place in shooting. <laughs> I see, so he's a good shooter, huh? Can't read that, so... Maybe someone in the comments can translate. I know that there are quite a few of you guys that can read Russian. Photo. Okay, so it's like PT or... Oh, matches. Oh, okay, I can take that. I couldn't take the ammo earlier, though. How about these? Did these open? All right, I know we can go light the candle. The door is closed with a key. Is that like your grandfather or something? Looks like a famous historical figure, maybe. Or a stock photo. One or the other. Okay, here we go. What happened? Ah! Okay, so what do we do now? <laughs> I lit up the room, guys. Can't use. Um, does this do anything? Can I see anything that I couldn't see before? Uh, can't pick up the candle, can't pick up the lamp. I guess, did it activate something elsewhere? Did I do that? Yeah, I did. I did. It activated as I was trying to read the note. Okay, let's go ahead. Save that, I guess. So downstairs is kind of uneventful. Let's go upstairs, look around for like a... A key or something, and we can look out for his rules as well. I've been using my stern eyebrows the whole time. Need to use my friendly eyebrows. Hey guys, it's John! This joke is never gonna get old. Put on your friendly eyebrows, everybody. Here's the rules. Here they are. They're in a fucking tome on his bed. <laughs> Keep the house clean. Check the room before going to bed. Accept parcels. Does see? Does he mean accept parcels, like receive them willingly, or does he mean like check the room but don't check the parcels? And most importantly, never go in the second bedroom, which I locked, in respect for Mr. Johnson. Thanks, man. I'm glad you wrote the freaking Ten Commandments down in your holy book and left it on the freaking bed for me. Okay, we can actually- now we can't hide in there. Good to know. We don't fit inside the closet. Kind of creepy to sleep beneath <laughs> that picture. Oh! For superintendent. If something happens, the safe code can be found on the photos. Dot 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 plus dot 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 equals dot 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 dot. Okay, so this is two. The safe code? Okay, so, up oh, 1925. This is also two. Oh, 1925. I gotta rotate the other one then, I think. Let's see what this said on the other side. Hi. 1926, we had 1925, 1926. I won't go out at night, it's dangerous. What? What? Okay, then there's gotta be something in that bathroom. Cause that's the only thing that I've done. And I don't know what it did. Apparently it did something, right? And let's, let's close the door so we can concentrate. Did it illuminate a key or like? What did it do? Friendly eyebrows. What did it do? Now I can get some sleep. I just walked around for a while, and then that popped up. So, um, 
I was trying to figure out what the hell to do. I actually looked on the Steam forums. No one has like played this game, it seems like. The developer behind this game is Peace, and uh, Peace created Case Number 8, which I played a couple months ago. FPS creator has stopped working. Okay, I'm back in. Let's hope it loads this time. There we go. All right. Fingers crossed. Yeah. Is it really something to celebrate? It's really. <laughs> yeah, I get to play more whispers. Someone's at the door. Uh oh. Dude, is this just a bare mattress you're sleeping on? There's no no bed sheets or anything. Who came to me late at night? I don't know, man. Uh, the door is locked, so. <laughs> oh, now it's open! Oh, okay, all right. <laughs> all right, hang on, hang on. <gasps> am I supposed to accept the parcel, or am I, am I supposed to not? I, the... Uh, the note left everything up to interpretation. Posting for Mr. Johnson. Okay. I won't go out at night, it's dangerous. I need to carry the parcel into the bedroom. Why? Why do I need, okay. Is he gonna open it up in there? Like, before going to sleep, I need to get around the house. Why? What? Well, is the parcel dropped off in here or not? Well, uh, first I need to go to the bedroom, and then I need to get around the house. Why? What's gonna happen? Jump scares. Here we go. This is... Because we've already seen these rooms, so something's had to have changed, right? Open. I still don't know why we lit that candle. Like, I don't know what that did. Let's go ahead and save. Let's go to the bathroom. By the way, I can't help but notice there's no toilet in here. Something I didn't notice. Maybe that's what the jump scare was about. It was the horror, the realization that there's no place to shit. What if I really need to pee at night, you know? I need to get around the house, I don't understand. Do we go in here? Door's closed with a key though. What do you mean I need to get around the house? What does that mean? And then I just go back to the bedroom and then it's just, just fades to black, why? Ah, it's anticlimactic. Was I just checking on things? Everything was fine. FPS creator has stopped working. I'm starting to see a trend here, folks. <sighs> All right, fingers crossed that it doesn't crash again. Ooh. I like how it just gently lowers me to the ground. Okay. What's in here? There's nothing in there. Uh, okay. The gramophone played by itself. All right. <laughs> we don't have time for this. Come on, let's uh, let's go down there. Jump scare. Jump scare. Jump scare. Nope. Let's save so I don't have to. I mean. Okay. I. Maybe someone just really likes music. An envelope. Well, open it up! I made a spare set of keys and sent them to your room as you requested. They lie in an envelope. Grabbed I. What? I thought you sent them to my room. Do I have them now? All right, let's go in here. What? Well, I ha I have the keys now, though. That's the thing. I have them now. Hi. Oh, wait, did he mean this one? 
Do we go in here now? He said, he said not to go in here though. Oh, just gonna, <laughs> just gonna do this number, I guess. <laughs> Great. So. Well then what's the point? <laughs> oh no! Oh no, where'd the, where'd the spooky bedsheet ghost go? It had a bed sheet, guys. It was a spooky ghost. Where'd it go? It likes music. Ah, there's the safe. Let's go ahead and save. Um. Oh, 1925 plus 1926. Okay, so that would be 3851, right? What'd I get? What? You can't just do that. You can't just say grabbed item, make a noise, and then. All right, whatever. Crazy puzzle, guys. That was, um. That was nuts. Sorry, if I, I, I'm looking off to the side because I want to make sure my audio doesn't stop recording. I've been having a lot of problems with that lately. And I would hate, you know, I, what'd I get if it wasn't a key to the store? Is it a key to like the next door in that upstairs bedroom? Anyway, I want to like catch it if it fucks up. So, <laughs> and I, I know I'm looking kind of paranoid. Sorry about that. All right. He's dead. This is Mr. Johnson, but he died. Then who invited me here? Okay, I, I kind of like that appreciation. I, I kind of appreciate that. Uh, I'm trying to figure out how to not say appreciation twice. I appreciate the attention to detail. There we go. I can't go any longer. I need you, Martha. Death took you too early, and I'm not going to put up with it. I'll find a way to revive you. Oh, so we got an Amnesia Dark Descent plot going on over here. I recently purchased an old book about dark magic, so I'll try to find a spell to bring you back. Can you imagine? <laughs> look, there's more ammo for a gun that we don't have. Well, let's look at the dark magic book. Come on, what's it? Dude, he died face palming. That's not a good sign. <laughs> Is that him? I think that's him. <laughs> okay. Someone's in the house. I need to go down to the basement. Why? What? Mr. Johnson is a hunter, so he must have a gun. Someone's in the house. Instead of going to my car and driving home, I should go down to the basement and be trapped here. The hell, dude? Where's even the basement? Don't we need a key to get in there? Do I, do I all of a sudden have keys? I don't... Hi there. Dude. He's the one who invited me! <laughs> oh. oh, he was not happy that I walked within five feet of him. He was, he has his personal space and I invaded it. FPS creator, stop working again! Perfect! So, um, you know, there's a difference between like a bad game, just, just one game that's bad, you know, and has like no entertainment value. And a game like this, which is bad, but it's fun bad. This is fun bad. Yeah, it is dangerous out there, but it's also dangerous in here. I'm just gonna, I'll see you later. Okay, he just let me walk in. He was like, oh, you're going to the basement? Cool, I'll meet you down there later. Uh, can you get me a soda? Or some crackers while you're down there? All right, um, no can do, by the way. I'm not, not doing that. Ooh, a typewriter. Okay. Oh, let me guess, the door was locked. <laughs> Puzzles, guys. 
Oh, that was his. That was his wife. That was his wife. That was. What? There's three different women in here. Who are you trying to revive? I attempted to summon Martha for the third time. I failed. I'm confused. I don't know what to do next. I think instead of Martha, other spirits came into our world. You fucked up! You, you fucked up. Congratulations on fucking up. Huh. Ooh. Oh, a bottle of whiskey. I don't know why I can pick these up. Why? Like, there's a ton of these, but I... Like, they're not acquirable. I can't do anything with them. Can I throw them, or...? Door is closed with a key. Okay. Alright, well... Wait, maybe we can go into this room, then. I'm not sure why that... Here, here, here. I put the key in the safe. I hid the safe in the wall. Since over the years, memory began to fail me, I wrote the code to the safe in one of the bottles that are in the room with the food on the label of my favorite beverage. Okay. So that's... That's it. You... You got... You got two safes, dude? Why not just put them both in the same safe? 7359. Okay, this one's clearly different than the others. <laughs> I was worried that I wouldn't be able to find it. 7359. Alright, so where's the, uh... The safe? It's hidden in the wall, right? Oh, Ripping these down. 7359. I got it. So is this... Closed with a key. Alright. Well, we'll just go out here and, uh... Okay, let's close it. Let's close the door, yeah. What... What did I get? I should not have started it. Now I see caricature shadows and silhouettes. Yesterday my cat was staring into a dark corner of my room, staring and not making a sound. But then I remember that my cat died a few years ago. Ooh, you forgot? How'd you forget? All right, my cat's been dead for years. My beloved pet. What I... Is this just a key? I think it's just a key for... For this other one. For this other room. Could be wrong. Here we go. Oh. Double basement? Double basement, guys. Hmm. I need to get out of this cursed house. So I've got... My face cam's covering it up, but I've got five shots. Okay. Okay, I don't know. I mean, you had the chance to get out of this house earlier. You walked right by the front door and you were like, I can't go out there at night. It's dangerous. Had to go into the deepest part of the house. Is there any ammo? Because I have run into some ammo. Can I please save? I, I killed him! That was kind of cool, actually. Okay, so I've got three shots left. I'll just tell you how many I have. You don't need to... You don't need to know. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. Thank you. Oh, where's he? Where'd he go? I need to find a ammo in this house and get out. Why? What? Why can't we just leave? Can't we just leave? Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. I'm not leaving without any ammo. Dude, you have three shots! I know where the ammo is, it's up here. Okay. So 
So now I have eight. Gonna reload. Good, didn't lose any. Okay, so now I have ammo, can I leave? Shoot. What? What? Wait, what? Oh, come on, man. I shot it dead on. FPS creator has crashed. Monster, are you there? Oh, so you duck back into that room and he disappears. What? This is very disappointing. He's dead. We'll reload one last time. I'm gonna save. That was, that was, <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> okay, let's go out to the car. We could have done this a long time ago, but hey, you know. I need to look for ammo before leaving. Why? Dude, you're done. You're done. Why do you need to look for ammo? I mean, I know exactly where it is. We're gonna have to shoot him again before we leave. So the first time he took two shots. Second time he took three shots. How many is it gonna take this time? Four? Just two. <laughs> Just two. Okay. <laughs> what was that hilarious noise that he made? Okay, what now? Just time to leave? Time to... Well, why? Why? <sighs> hmm. Don't crash. Oh, it crashed. FPSC game has stopped working. <laughs> I like how immediately he drops to the floor. Kind of satisfying, to be honest. All right, let's uh, get in the car and go, I guess. Can I go back inside and save, I wonder? No sense in returning. Oh, you're gonna bring sense into this now, huh? You could have left like half an hour ago. Figured I would let you know that. All right, please don't crash. Please. Uh, it crashed again. It crashed again. It took away my gun. Uh, okay. <laughs> I didn't actually have to shoot him. That's pretty good. All right, let's just uh, run to the car then. It took away my gun. Did you guys see that? <gasps> what? What? Oh, that was bullshit. I made it. Just because the character stopped and waited for the freaking loading screen to finish. FPS creator has crashed! All right, good, I kept my gun this time. I do like killing him. It is strangely satisfying. I know I already said that, but... Like, uh, it's not bad. Not bad at all. Too bad the game crashes like every other loading screen. Okay, this is the fourth time. I've reached this loading screen, and I'm really hoping it works this time. Thank God. Where are we? What? What is even happening? What? Are we? If fuel runs out, I need to look around. Are you shitting me? This would be happening with or without the horror motif though. Even if you went to the house and everything went fine, you would still run out of fuel. 
Are you at the same house? You're at, you're at a different house, right? It's my neighbor's house. My neighbor's house. You're the you're what? You're the superintendent, right? Or whatever, right? You're not. You're not actually the person who lives there. This isn't actually your neighbor, is it? Whatever. I'm just nitpicking at this point. Hi. Nobody in there. Okay. Another chained door. Door is blocked. The bolt clippers seem to be in the car. They do, huh? I wonder who we're gonna encounter on our way back. There wasn't enough time to take everything, so I left this note. All that are not taken, I will ask the caretaker of the house to return. The key to the house I left behind, along with the house itself. What? What? So this house also has a caretaker? Nobody wants to take care of their own damn houses, is what I'm learning. Alright, there's no point in going down there. Alright, let's shoot... Shoot the shadow guy again. Really hope I don't die. The key? Where, where did I grab it from? Are you shitting me? This game's making me mad now. I gra grabbed the key. Is it the bolt clippers? You grabbed the key. Okay. The key. What is, what is this switch in the wooden floor? Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, sure. Let's open up the trap door. Empty canister. <laughs> I need to look for fuel. There should be some in the base. Why would there be fuel? In uh. That's, that's bullshit. That's bullshit. All right, guys. I took a little break and I came back and I killed this guy. And I don't have footage of it because I tried it over and over again without recording it until it finally worked, so. Just know that he's dead. You've seen him die a million times. We can finally go inside, I think. The door is closed with a key. I guess the switch opened up a hatch? Let's do this. Good. I would love a place to save. Don't you dare crash on me. There hasn't been a place to save this entire time. I really need a typewriter. Without fuel, I can't go anywhere. These better not cra- uh, these better not- <laughs> Damn it, I hurt my foot and I lost my gun. <laughs> Are you freaking kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? Well then what... What did I get all that ammo for? Oh my god. He made me run around that house getting ammo. For nothing. For absolutely nothing. Amazing. Alright, let's uh, hang around in this hallway. I do like that he moves with kind of a limp now. That's a nice touch. Typewriter. Oh. Oh, I can save. Look at this great hay. Alright, it's like, it's like Super Nintendo hay. I'm just mad now, sorry, I had to go cool down, honestly. Earlier, I had to take a break, like a stress break. <laughs> Not because I was scared, but because it was just annoying the piss out of me. Da -da -da -da. What do you mean empty? Look, it's got a graphic of all the freaking coins. Just a flat JPEG in there. Tons of coins. We found a treasure chest, dude. There's nothing in there. Oh, this game. Like, I genuinely like some things about it. It's very, uh, very Phobia 1.5, if you guys remember me playing that game. What did I get? What did I get? Did I get a, a key? 
Did I get a key or, or what's the... So it's just key roulette over here? That's what the chests are for? Door is blocked. It's not locked, it's blocked. Like someone's on the other side... Holding us back. Alright. Okay. Hey there. That's... Why? Is that the dead guy? Huh. <sighs> From before? The... The guy who lived in the house? Oh. Just so happens to be another... Well then what was the point? What was the point of... Losing the gun? Medicine chest. Now I feel much better. Oh, we've solved all the problems that happened like two seconds ago. Is that it? So now what? Oh. You just shoot the lock off. That's nice and simple. You just walked on over the pit, did ya? Alright then. Fuck. Only four shots left. I'm doing this, guys. Closed with a key? Are you serious? Closed with a key. Well... Oh god, I've only got two left. Oh, I'm out. I'm out. I don't have anything left. It took away my gun. It took away my gun. Now I need to get out of here. Guys, it took away my gun. It did that stupid bug again. Damn it. All right. I got all three ammo boxes. Got the key, got the fuel, and now I am out. Okay. I'm just gonna systematically move through these guys. I'm not taking any more chances. He takes three? Right. Yeah, he definitely... He definitely would, wouldn't he? There's one right there. I heard the noise. Crap. Oh my god. There's one right there. Holy shit. I am so sick of this. I am so sick of these guys. Here we go. What'd I do? I beat it! I beat it! I got out! I survived! I'm definitely... Not including this in the video because this is a copyright claim waiting to happen So that's it That was whispers guys um, So I actually like some things about this game as I said before I like how phobia like it is but 
I pretty much don't care for much else. It's basically a key hunt with a lot of loading screen crashes. What is happening right now? Anything? <laughs> Anything at all? Uh, okay, I'm just gonna leave it then. Uh, not worth five bucks at all. Um, I think in some ways it was better than case number eight, the developer's previous work, but um, and it's better than a lot of stuff on Steam. It was a fun kind of bad. It wasn't like bad, bad. Um, but yeah, not worth five bucks. I can name like five indie horror games on Steam that you should get instead of this one that are under five bucks. Uh, Pony Island, which I believe is five. Uh, I'm Scared 2016, which is $4. Uh, Dead End Road, also $4. Uh, Welcome to the Game is $2. And Spooky Jumpscare Mansion is free. So there you go. Those are five games that you should get instead of this one if you haven't played any of those. I will see you guys later. There's the menu. I don't know why it took so long to get here. <laughs> Let me know what you thought in the comments. I'll see you guys in the next video. Think critically.